Wow, it's second semester. Have you checked yeah. your schedules? I haven't. Wow. I wonder what they are. Let's check it. Why, did I get AP Computer Science? I didn't sign up for this. Is that AP Japanese? Oh my gosh. And we can't change our classes once we get them. Why do I have AP Japanese? What do we do now? Silly sophomores. They have bad memes to procrastinate on everything. Ugh, I know. They haven't even set up their schedules yet. I mean, the process is so easy. We should probably walk them through. Here's how you sign up for your short classes. So first, Sam, you're, you will receive your registration packet from your SAS teacher. Um, when you're signing up, it's really important that you make informed, good decisions. Um, you're going to register for the classes that you need to graduate, but also be thinking about your post-high school plans. Um, your choices are final, and we will hold, a, hold you to them, so choose wisely and choose well. Nearly all students will be required to take classes in the four core areas, which are math, English, social studies, and science. This is your registration guide. It's been pushed to your iPad electronically. Your iPad needs to have the most current updates for you to get it. The step-by-step -step directions for accessing the registration guide are on your student direction sheet, um, which is right here. The registration guide is also available on our school, school website and the school district website. This is your registration form. It's color-coded by grade level. Use the one for your grade level. Make sure you read the directions on your registration forms and fill out the registration completely following all directions. Phew! That was a lot of information. But it's very important because they were choosing their classes. To help you make informed decisions, we've got some students talking to you about the classes. Let's throw it over to them. Read the registration guide. Most questions are answered in the guide. Having trouble access it? Hard copies are available in the counseling office during your free time. Talk to your current teachers to see what classes you can take next year because your teachers know you better and they know their department courses the best. Keep your graduation requirements in mind. Your graduation checklist shows completed semester credits that you've earned by passing your classes. If there's an error, let your counselor know. Get informed about the courses, talk to the teachers who teach them, or attend the optional info sessions if they're available. Keep your social life in mind, like how much time do you re realistically have for homework? Keep college requirements in mind. Some colleges may look for more than what's required in the Shorewood Diploma. So, for example, senior math. Some colleges may even want to see you challenging yourself your last year of high school. Still have questions? Counselors can help you during drop-in times, before school, breaks, lunch, and after school. We just have one teensy little thing before we let you go with registration. All choices you make are final unless certain circumstances apply. Please do choose carefully. Sam, Caleb, are you ready? I have carefully considered the homework load of the classes I selected, as well as outside activities that may place demands on my time, such as extracurricular activities, both in and out of school, work, family obligations, etc. I have chosen an appropriately challenging, yet reasonable course load. I understand that once I indicate I want to take a class, I will not be able to alter my choices unless the class is not offered. I have talked to my teachers, family, and or counselor for advice. If I have selected an honors or advanced placement class, I will review the summer assignment or syllabus or course information and am committed to staying in honors or AP all year. I also understand that Shorewood administration may adjust my selections to increase rigor or offer intensive interventions if my grades, test scores, and or teacher recommendations indicate that I may need additional support to master grade level expectations. Oh shoot, schedules are due today. I don't know if I fill mine out. Whew, now I won't have to take strength and fit. Oh, that was a dream. Really realistic.